whatever you want on it. It's massive. Not a lot of people can finish. What's up, it's Luis from America's Best Restaurants and we travel the country coast to coast to find the places where you need to eat at on a weekly basis. And this week we're in Bloomington, Indiana and today we're at a restaurant called B-Town Diner. We're gonna get to talk to Miranda, who's the owner. We're gonna see some of their cool items like their haystack plus a couple of other things. Look, I know you're hungry because you're watching this. So why don't you come with me? Let's go check it out. everybody so now we are inside b-town diner we're here with miranda who's the owner so miranda thank you for having us appreciate it yeah so i right off the bat i gotta tell you one thing i love your hair your hair is uh -huh. awesome it's like a statement it's like thank you. miranda's here and we're about to dominate so that's <laughs> so this that's awesome so thank miranda you tell me how did you get into the restaurant industry well, I uh, have been in the restaurant industry for most of my adult career. Okay. So I started off as a cook. I've been a cook, I've been a prep cook. I was a server for quite some time. Okay. And about eight years ago, I worked with the previous owner to open this place. And oh, nice. now it's been mine for about three years. That's awesome. So basically the, the previous owner kind of came to you to see if you had an interest in owning it. And you're like, yep, I'm in. Oh, absolutely. This is my baby. I was here five years before, so why okay. not? Yeah. Okay, love it, love it. I know you work front of house, back of house, but I'm really interested to know. So tell me about the back of house. What do you do in back of house? Well, I do everything in the back of house. I still okay. do. Sometimes I run this place all by myself. Okay. Uh, I ran the fryer side of our kitchen for a year, and I can do everything: flip eggs, uh, make the best omelets and hash browns. So. Okay, so yeah. basically you're like beast mode when you're in the kitchen. That's uh, what's happening I, I'm right now. I'm a beast. Now. Okay. Front and back. Love it. That's awesome. That's <laughs> absolutely awesome. I I, yeah. I really love to hear that confidence. You know yeah. that the restaurant Customer, tours. Customers have. say that too. So okay, that there you go. So it's yeah. true then, right? <laughs> it's it's got to be true. Okay, very very cool. So the focus of your diner, tell me, like in the food, what is the the main kind of like focus? Okay, we're we're a breakfast place, okay. so we're cool. primary breakfast American. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a lot of products that are uh, made in house. The sweet cream on the French toast that's okay. made in house, the gravy biscuits, the hash browns oh, wow. we shred here. So a lot, a lot of products, but we're wow. American breakfast. Okay, love it. Well, that's a perfect segue into the food. So we got some food items here. We got some coffee. We're gonna talk about that here in a little bit, but let's talk about the food first. So tell me, what do we have here? Because I've never seen this. This is gonna. Both of these are legendary items. So that's the stuffed French toast. That's okay. the house made sweet cream and strawberry. So it's the stuffed French toast, sweet cream, and strawberry. Mmm, that's really good. Wow. Thank you. Hmm. Now, is this a big seller with the strawberry? Or are there others? The, I'm assuming you have others, right? Yeah, yeah. The, so the best selling one is the banana Nutella. Okay. Yeah. Banana Nutella? Banana Nutella. Sign me up. That's what I want. <laughs> that's awesome. This is really, really good. Awesome. Thank really you. Really good. I've never seen it like that in this interpretation. I think I even forgot to put syrup on it, but you know what? Yeah. It doesn't need you it. Don't I think need it's it. you I think it's it. phenomenal the way it, that cream is awesome. Thank you. That is so good. Wow. <laughs> now, this monstrosity happening here. Let, let, let's take a look and see what, what's happening here. So tell me, what is this monstrosity? This is the haystack. So this is a bed of hash browns. If biscuits and gravy on top of that, eggs, you can get cheese, corned beef. We'll really put whatever you want on it. It's massive. Mm. Not a lot of people can finish it. Hmm. How many people order this thing for breakfast? Oh, a, a large percentage of our customers. Is that a lot of college kids? This is their favorite food. I can imagine. <laughs> That's awesome. That's Thank really you. good. I mean, there's a lot of things happening here. Great flavors. I can taste that pepper, kind of like in the back end. That's really, yep. really good. That special secret really house-made seasoning. Now. I know when we walked in, there was one thing you asked me for. You said, can we talk about the coffee? I'm like, yeah, we can totally do whatever you want. Yeah, so absolutely. So tell me about the coffee. So this is Sober Joe coffee. We okay. love it. Customers love it. Uh, we appreciate the work that they do in the recovery community here in Bloomington. 
um, and it's locally sourced and just all around great coffee. That's awesome. Yeah. That's really, really, really great. Now, what is one item that maybe it's like a little diamond in the rough in the menu that when somebody finds it, that's like their go-to? Uh, the chicken and waffles. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's a good one. Okay. <laughs> All right. I had to think there for a minute. No, that's totally there's, cool. There's lots of diamonds in the rough. Okay, so what's another one? Give me one more. You wouldn't do that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, we, we have great salads. We have a Cajun okay. chicken salad okay. for, as a lunch option. It's really great. Really? We make Cajun ranch in-house. Oh, really? We, people enjoy that too. That's very cool. Very cool. Look, everybody, if you're looking for more restaurants like Beat Town Diner, if you like restaurant content, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit that bell notification so you know whenever we drop a new episode. So Miranda, you've been an amazing guest, but I got to ask you, how do people find out more information about your restaurant? So we're on Instagram and Facebook okay. and uh, just BeatTownDiner.com or you can stop by. What's the address? Okay. 211 North Walnut Street. We're right across from the Bluebird in the same building as Brothers. Okay, love it. So look, everybody, if you are local, you need to be stopping here on a weekly basis, if not multiple times a week. And if you're traveling, you gotta stop by B-Town Diner. You gotta get this monstrosity happening here. You gotta get the French toast. You gotta get everything that they have in the menu. Plus the gems in the rough that she mentioned, because you know, she said, oh, I know you're gonna do that for the second one, <laughs> right? <laughs> And also, you can find our full listing for them on AmericasBestRestaurants.com. And that's pretty much it for us. Actually, I was going to take a bite of food, but we agreed earlier off camera, coffee, right? Yeah, so coffee, we got to try So we're going to sign off, and we're going to see you guys on the next one.